Welcome back to Joystick News, fellow gamers. In today's deep dive, we're venturing into the fascinating world of Dragon's Dogma 2, and more specifically, into the art of pawn management. Managing your pawns effectively is crucial to conquering the myriad of challenges you'll face in this epic adventure. So, buckle up as we delve into six essential tips for turning your pawns into the ultimate allies. Let's get started. Intro to Pawn Management First off, let's talk about what makes pawns so special in Dragon's Dogma 2. These loyal companions are more than just NPCs. They are the backbone of your adventure, aiding you in battle, providing valuable insights, and even carrying your loot. But to maximize their effectiveness, you need to give them a little love and attention. And by that, I mean gearing them up, choosing the right specializations, and mastering the command system. 6 Essential Tips for Pawn Management Number 6. Gear up your pawns Starting with the basics, never forget to arm and gear up your main pawn as well as any others you recruit. Just like your character, pawns need the best weapons and armor to survive the dangers of Dragon's Dogma 2. Upgrading their gear is equally important as it significantly boosts their combat effectiveness. Remember, a well-equipped pawn is the difference between victory and defeat. Number 5. Diversify your party Next up, diversity is key. With five different pawn specializations available, you want to make sure your party covers a wide range of skills. From the battle-hardened warrior to the mystic mage, each specialization brings something unique to the table. Avoid overlapping specializations to ensure your team can handle any situation thrown at it. Number 4. Master Pawn Commands Now, let's talk tactics. Pawn commands are crucial for directing your allies in combat and making strategic decisions on the fly. Whether you're calling them to your side with the to me command or directing a mage to levitate to an out of reach chest, understanding and utilizing these commands can turn the tide of battle in your favor. Number 3. Regularly recruit new pawns. Moving on, always keep your pawn roster fresh. Since recruited pawns don't level up, you'll want to visit Riftstones regularly to swap out lower level allies for those matching or exceeding your current level. This keeps your team strong and capable, ready to face whatever dangers lie ahead. Number 2. Beware of Dragon's Plague A more ominous tip is to be vigilant about Dragon's Plague, a unique affliction that can turn your pawns against you. Keep an eye out for symptoms like red eyes or coughing, and don't hesitate to dismiss any pawn showing signs of the plague. It's harsh, but necessary to prevent a full-blown outbreak. Number 1. Ensure everyone can heal. Last but not least, make sure all your pawns have access to healing, whether through curatives in their inventory or by having a mage or chirogen in your party. Healing is essential for survival, so don't overlook this critical aspect of pawn management. Mastering these six tips will not only improve your pawn's performance, but also enhance your overall experience in Dragon's Dogma 2. Remember, your pawns are more than just followers, they're your partners in this grand adventure. Treat them well, and they'll be the key to your success. That wraps up our guide on managing pawns in Dragon's Dogma 2. Do you have any tips or tricks of your own? Share them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more gaming insights and tips from Joystick News. Until next time, keep gaming.